at the Dollar Tree, as you can see, picking up a few more items to give you guys a little review of uh, some of the weirdest things we find here. Thanks for watching. Okay guys, welcome back. Today I got something very special to share with you that I just picked up. This is for those of you who are on a serious budget, but you're also worried about your home security. So I picked this up at the Dollar Tree for a total price of $1. No tax here in the state of Oregon, so $1 even. Uh, I'm looking online to see if I can find this for sale anywhere else, to see what anyone else wants for it with shipping. But as far as I'm concerned and as far as I've seen, this is the cheapest security system, we'll call it, in the world, in existence. So here's what I was able to find on Amazon. You can see there's a couple results that are the similar sort of product, but none of them get anywhere close to a dollar each. There's a few multi-packs that are like between $10 and $20, but there's nothing that even comes close. Maybe the closest is like $2.50 or $3 each. Aside from it being free, this is about as cheap as you can get at $1. Install it on one of our doors or windows and see if this thing will actually work. All right, so let's take a look here at the actual packaging. It says, Easy to install alert system, obviously. It better be easy to install. I don't know. It looks like maybe there are some screw holes on there. I don't really want to be screwing this into my wall or door. So hopefully it's adhesive. Alarm sounds when window, door, or cabinet is open. So it sounds like what they're suggesting is that if you got kids or a spouse or somebody who won't stop eating from the damn cupboards in the kitchen, you can put this on the cupboards and it will alert you when they're going for a snack and you can come out and slap them across the face, tell them to stop eating. And it says deters crime. It doesn't stop it, doesn't prevent it, just deters it. And I'm guessing that's the piercing sound, because that's all it does is it makes an awful screech. So, it says down here it comes with three alkaline LR44 batteries, which I'm glad they're included because I don't know where I would pick those up. Those are probably the ones that you find in your grandma's hearing aid, which are always more expensive than regular, you know, double AA, A, triple A batteries. Okay, so then we got the main unit and then the bar magnet. So what I'm I'm guessing the way that this works is when the magnet's removed from next to the main unit, that's when the alarm sounds. So it looks like we just put the batteries in, stick them to the wall, test it, or window, get them in position, switch it on, there you go. So this is actually imported to the U.S., it says down here, which is amazing to me that they can make a product like this, import it to the U.S., and sell it for a dollar and still make a profit. So let's rip this guy open. Okay, just as we figured, we got some adhesive on the back. That's very nice. I really didn't want to screw it into the wall, but <laughs> adhesive right here, you can tell it's cockeyed. So I either put it on poorly or just in a hurry or something like that, but it is a dollar product, so I won't complain. It's not 3M tape. Uh, it does come with the batteries already inside of it. So let's see if we can hear this thing make a noise. Oh wow, that is annoying. Holy crap. That is an awful sound. We go out of town pretty often, so I think what I want to do is I want to put it on the front door. We go out of town, I can flick the little on switch, we can leave. And if anybody decides to break in, then maybe they'll hear that sound and they'll leave. That combined with our cheapest security cameras from the other video. We got pretty, pretty Fort Knox type apartment here, so I'm gonna get it put on top of the door here, and we're gonna test out, see if this thing actually works. Okay guys, so I was actually able to use the, the metal that's in this door to attract the magnet on here so I didn't even have to stick it. And then this guy right here, I was afraid the molding was gonna stick it out too far, but I stuck it on and it's on right now and it's not making a noise, so let's give it a test here. That's actually not bad at all. That thing's so annoying. Hey, check it out. It's a buck. Thanks for watching.